It's very commonly believed and very well understood by way of example that peer pressure will lead to beer pressure. Yeah. And beer pressure will lead to nothing other than blood pressure. Befriend somebody that will give you benefit. Befriend somebody that will do you some good. Which basis do we choose our friends? Are we cautious who we take as friends? If somebody is looking hard, you know, someone pulls off of being a bit of a rude boy. Someone can pull off of being a bit of a G, he rolls. People look at him and say, yeah, my man's on road, he's on road. So we like to associate ourselves with people like that. Forgive me for talking frank, but this is what how people have come to. This is what is attractive to us. Why, because he's got a new plate car? Because he's got a trap around his hands? Because he's rolling with a gold chain? He's making a disgrace of the dinner and you think he's good? My man's a bad boy. My man's a rude boy. What rude boy? Destroying the lives of the people. Selling drugs to the people. Selling drugs to your own Muslim brothers. Making your own Muslim brothers crackheads and brownheads. Is this what we are turned to? Is this what we have become? And he's a bad boy? He's a joker. He's an animal. Put him behind bars. He's better to stay there and rock. Make Toba, then Alhamdulillah come back. No Toba, stay there like an animal. Die like an animal. You deserve a dog death. How can he be a bad boy? Bah man, bad boy, bad. So you're happy that he's like that? You should be shedding tears, my brother, that this is the attraction of the youth. We know what's going on. We know what people are going through. It's not like we've just come from a straw hut and come into the masjid. We know what's on road. And the pull it's got is unbelievable. The youngsters are getting pulled in. Why? Outside glamour. It looks good. Ewok blood, Wagwan blood, Yukul blood. What's this? But it looks good. I know words which you don't know. So I say that extra bit louder because I want man to notice me. We're following those ways which have got no success. When we see some of these boys on road, they put their head down in shame. They inside, they know it's wrong. But they're in a circle of friends which put them in that situation. They can't get out. They feel helpless. Be careful who you befriend. Be careful who your circle of friends is. Be careful who you're rolling with. Be careful who you're on road with. You may want to pull yourself out of the hole. They will kick you on your face and put you back down. And we fall victim because it looks attractive. He's built himself a house in Jahannam, the fire in Jahannam by selling things which are wrong, by doing things which are wrong. Are these are the sort of people we want to roll around with?